I love playing Brahms' Fourth Symphony because it calls on me to create a wide range of emotions, textures, timbres on the horn. And that's a challenge, but also a delight. Brahms' Symphony No. 4 is such a beautiful, warm piece of music. And horn players love playing Brahms because he calls for this warm, rich, noble tonality. And that's where we live. That's the horn player's bread and butter. We're not the only instruments that have warm, gorgeous sounds. Brahms also writes for the violas and the cellos and the bassoons and the, as well as the horn. And we all revel in making this gorgeous, warm sound together. Brahms also writes for the violins and the flute and the oboe, beautiful melodic lines that come out kind of as the sunshine, that's the sunlight in, in his pieces of music. Another interesting aspect to this concert is the return of Christoph von Dachnani. He made his NSO debut in 2006, conducting Brahms' first symphony. And that was a great experience for all of us. He's quite a Brahms expert does all of the romantic repertoire very, very beautifully. So all of us in the NSO are looking forward to Dachnani's return when he conducts Brahms' Fourth Symphony. I'm Laurel Olson, acting principal horn of the National Symphony. NSO, so inspiring. I hope to see you soon at the Kennedy Center.